Now, Lieutenant Governor Pamela Evitt spent the day in the Low Country. She's been discussing the topic of youth employment. News 2's Berkeley County reporter Raymond Owens has that story from Goose Creek. The Lieutenant Governor spent time here at the Goose Creek Chick-fil-A learning about how they do business here, but also learning about the skills some of their younger employees are learning. This mobile through lane has really increased our capacity um, to serve more guests um, and, and really utilize our team members to have that hospitable Chick-fil-A experience at the window as well. And you do. You guys do a great job helping like set up the workforce of tomorrow yeah. just with those soft skills. Yeah. Soft skills that employees I talk to say they're learning here on a daily basis. So discipline, that's one of the big things for me. So um, being a full-time student, I have to discipline myself, um, doing schoolwork and then coming to work and then being able to serve those guests. So just being able to set back, no matter how busy, no matter how stressed I am, knowing that I have a great team to rely on and support me in any way that I can is really reassuring. I've learned lots of communication skills as well as community skills. Um, we see people from all walks of life here at Chick-fil-A. Um, um, so many people come through the drive through Evett toured the Goose Creek Chick-fil-A for about an hour this afternoon. 30 to 50 employees, many of them young people, are working on any given day here. Evett and the executive director of the South Carolina Department of Employment and Workforce, William Floyd, held a press conference earlier this afternoon at the North Charleston Coliseum. They announced an online database website with jobs available for youth in the state. We connect people with work and work with people, especially included our youth. So some youth are looking for part-time jobs because they haven't graduated yet. There's a great opportunity to do that through uh, the Lieutenant Governor's website that she's initiated. Teenagers can search for jobs based on their zip code and find out about opportunities available for them. How do we help, first of all, small businesses by getting kids working? Getting a message to parents. Parents, we need you to get your kids off the couch. If you kick them out of the house to get them a job, you know, when they're young, that is something that'll be a runway of success for them forever. And it's not a bad thing. We have that new jobs website linked at our website. Just log on to countonto.com. In Goose Creek, I'm Raymond Owens, Count On Two.